Ah, wireless dreamer's back. King of geometry. He loves his artistic works. Let's get down and uh, see what we got. He's been away for a while. Ooh, Rubik cubes. Semi not coloured. <laughs> right, it looks dark, but of course this is a moon, so who knows? We'll just check the time. Okay, it's about midnight. Uh, let's have a look at the lights while we've got darkness anyway. Uh, there's no lights up there, so that's okay. Hologram, shouty man, twirly things. <laughs> he loves his twirly things. There's two Rubik Cube efforts there. Well, three actually. Sorry, I meant three. I didn't say three. It wasn't me. We've got two blobby bits lit. But they do anyway, don't they? Uh, looks like a text message over there. And we got a big swirly blue thing there. That's nice. Right, continue waiting. Okay, I think it's as daylight as we're going to get. Let's get out of here. Um, I noticed the, the, the cubes was actually red, green and yellow. At first I thought you could cut them in as Rubik's, that'd be good. What we got over here? Uh, we got the, uh, the, um, what's that bloody purple stuff called? I don't know. I well, don't bother with it. Uh, okay, what, let's, have a look, let's have a look at what we're actually landed on because it's an actual hand. Okay, there it is. <laughs> That's a pretty neat landing pad. Uh, the hands there to stop you falling off is an earthquake or something, I guess. Uh, even the uh, even the fingers are kind of like one's longer than you know, one's longer than the other, so they're okay. Let's get off. So we look at the cubes. Let me just get on top. Uh, if I can land there. Whoa! Okay, I'm on. <laughs> Um, as you can see, cubes, you can see the flight deck again. I should have done it from up here. Let's go to the next item. That's the cubes. This is kind of twisty. Let's go and have a look. Get closer. It's a low gravity planet, so it's not, I can uh, get away with hurting myself. We're going to have a look outside via the camera. Uh, so it's kind of a, like a, a a swirl. Curl goes inside and outside of each other again. I don't know what they're actually made of. I've no idea. That's nothing unusual for me anyway. We've got two bollocks. <laughs> Nicely positioned. Let's um, try next thing. What's the next item? We don't know because we've stuck behind this orange thing. Okay, we're up here. Uh, come on, get up. I guess you're next. The blue uh, race initiators made of. Uh, let's have a quick look at it up here while we're here. Nice petal arrangements and the flower jobs. Let's go and see if we can land on the damn thing. Yeah, I think I caught that. <laughs> I missed the first time, but it's okay. Uh, we won't be able to see much, so I'll go to camera again. So, race initiators. Big petals. Those shell things, anyway. They look like petals. So he's got a big flower. Above an arrangement of flowers. we we'll get on the floor for that one. Right, stand back a bit, and uh, we'll have another quick camera view there, it'll save me wandering around. So, yep, large gravitino balls. They're over large, obviously. And gamma weed at the bottom as well, by the look of it. Um, 
some, what they call them, gut rots and the other one. What's that red one? The purple one. Oh, forgotten. Never mind. You'll know. <laughs> so there's the flower in the middle on that one. A big gravitino type ball plant. Right, close. Moving on. We got steps. Let's go for some steps. So we got two shouty gecks. Nicely laid there. Um, just, oh his feet are just on the floor there, that's good. Uh, there seems to be a damn thing here. Oh look, this is one of his favourite things. Miniature base terminus. Is it upside down? Of course it is. Oh, and a save cube. It's upside down, we can see because we'll open that. And there it is. <laughs> I really like that. Upside down portal. Uh, we've got a teleport. Should we go, let's check the rest of the floor out here. Uh, greetings. My thank you. That's because you couldn't spell salutations. Uh, we got a big pillar here. What's that made of? Can't see because it's in the dark. Hang on, let's go to the other one. Okay. It's still getting dark. Is it getting dark? It's only 11 o'clock. It might be a cloud or something. Or I'm in underneath this, maybe. Yeah? Oh, there's the sun. Okay. We're just underneath. Let's get in the sun and get warmed up. So it's made of windows. I recognise the windows. I don't want to recognise the bits on the inside, though. Let's get on top. Perhaps it'll enlighten me. Did I? Well, missed. Sorry. But I seen... Autonomous mining units. Is that what they are? I don't think that's what they are, because that's, that's a roof or wall section, isn't it? So it's just encased it, that's all. Just in case. Uh, we did that one, that's done, that side. Uh, we got the other, another type over there. Go and check this one. Oh, I jumped again because I thought I was going to slip off. Uh, made of labels. <laughs> labels with the uh, fireflies running around it as well as only noticed that a few months ago fireflies everywhere let's have a look at what's here because you can't actually see i'll get the camera again labels he's got a big fire in there just to keep my feet warm at the moment because i'm stood on the top and it's just a general building i don't think there's any way in so we look down the base end just to make sure. No, can't see no doors. No doors. Okay. So next piece is this big well, it's one of the horns I guess. I'm gonna jump over onto this one, um, try and get over to the big blue thing there. Uh, I don't know whether I'm going to make it, but that'll do. Actually, if I get to the middle here... Okay, we're on this centre horn section. I guess that's why it's called the horn. I have no idea really, but there you go. Let's go, let's try, try and walk up as far as I can go. Uh, give me time to jump over to the blue thing. Ah, I keep slipping. Ah. Okay, that's gonna have to do. Let's get over there. Good job it's low gravity, I can jump a bit further. I don't know whether I can land successfully on it first try. Whoa, no. Whoa, no. No. Okay, what I'm going to do is swap to camera mode. And okay, so I jumped higher. 
and then swap the camera so we can have a look. That's interesting. Rings? What are the rings, the dark rings made of then? I have no idea what they are. Okay. But look at the, uh, how many bits are in there. That's a huge number of bits. I just don't know how you get the patience for this, man. Okay, let's get off. Oh, right. Made it to the uh, transport. It's obviously going in that ball because I can see a uh, save beacon there. Let's get inside. Go up. Right, inside. There's the roof. Is my light on? Okay, I turn my light on, there's no difference. Uh, so, save beacon. That's about all that's up here. Is there a way down? I can't imagine this much... Oh, stairs. I was going to say, I can't imagine this much space and he's not put floors in it. So, we've got another big ring light. Woo! Big rig. Open area. We yeah, could have put some building in here. Uh, so there's the teleport cable. We can see the teleport cable, and the floor it is nicely ring. Uh, hang on, I've got an idea. Okay, I can see. Ignore my beacon there. There's a little red line in there. That's the wiring. So he's used that right through the middle, I expect. So that means there must be a way down further. Obviously. Here it is. So again, we've probably gone through there. Another empty floor, but it's fine. We can have a sit down. Rest after coming down all those stairs. Uh, is there another... Nothing down there. Check over here. Nope, doesn't seem to be, but it, it looks like it's... Should I try it? <laughs> ah, you know I will. Right, go. We'll try and get down lower, see what's down lower if there's anything. There is a spot down here. And that is the lowest level, so... There's actually nothing here, although well, there is a light. Hmm. Okay, let's get out of here again then. If I can. Ah, of course you can. Up there. We have to go all the way up now. Oh, stuck on the stairs. Let's go all the way back up to find the teleport. Not that room, is it? Not that one. Uh, probably this one, isn't it? There it is. So we are now going to go out of here and try and get a look at the... wherever it's gone. Up there, that horn. Hmm, okay. So I guess we want to get as high as we can get. Oh! Bollocks. Right, hang on. Okay, I landed up on the sphere. I'm thinking how am I going to get up on this horn? Uh, perhaps I probably don't need to. I could use the camera from here, can't I? I'm on top of the sphere. i use the camera. Okay, so this horn, this is one end. Uh, we'll just come back a bit, get that in. I mean, get that in. I moved away from the mic. I was... <laughs> I tried looking around the mic. It's not even in the way. Oh dear, I'm losing my marbles. I, again, don't know what it's made of, but I think I've seen that shape somewhere. Let's go up higher. So quite a few pieces just for this one wavy 
horn. That is, I am really, I just don't know how you do it, man. I'd be frustrated as hell. Even the, um, I don't know what shape that is. I don't know how many count, I'm not counting the sides, but there's ins and outs on that one as well. So, um, <laughs> I like how it's left my shadow there. <laughs> yeah. I'm Peter Pan, there's my shadow. Right, let's get off. And that just about wraps it up. If we can find my ship. Uh, wait, we didn't go, where's the base? I didn't get the coordinates. Base computer must be down here somewhere. Let's get off again. Right, we're back down. Let's try and find where the base computer is. No, you're not it. Oh, there it is. It's in here. Yep, Horns of Geometry 2. Hmm, okay, wireless streamer. Just grab the uh, coordinates a second. Okay, and that's it. There we go. Let's just go over here, climb back in the hand. And there we have it. We're done. I didn't notice those yellow bits before, but then <laughs> that's okay. Just because it's getting dark again. Yep, the sun's gone down. Yeah, it's going down. That's the way it went. So we'll see you later. Ta-ra!